In this video, we're going to be looking at some of the brand new features inside the latest update for Force 3.0.2. This brings splice integration via Wi-Fi and sample audition in sync to your browser. So inside 3.0.2, we've added splice integration and synchronization of our samples in our browser. So if we go to load and we head over, you see a splice logo, but then underneath this, if you now hit the audition button, you can now see warp sync and auto. This allows us to preview any sample loops with embedded tempo information. So let's look at accessing our splice sample content first. We head over to settings, we go to Wi-Fi and make sure you're connected to your local network. Once this is done, we head down to our splice icon. Now I've already linked force to my splice account, which you can follow the full setup on our splice integration tutorial. So I'm now going to press check for updates, and this is going to look for any new samples I've added to my Splice account. And it's found nine new samples, so I press sync, and it's now transferring these samples directly from my account into my Force hard drive. Once completed, it will say number of samples downloaded is nine. Now to access these samples, I simply press load, go over to my Splice browser, and here I can now search through different types of categories. So I'm going to go to packs and here are all my packs that I've loaded and here's the new samples that I transferred from Boy Wonder. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to transfer some of these samples onto the pads and then we can make a quick beat directly from these sounds. So you can see how easy the process is of bringing samples via Wi-Fi technology directly into your force utilizing your splice content. Now we've added our samples to our pads, we can work on some different types of rhythms and then we can start recording our idea. So let's hit record, which will start our clip automatically. Let's add our metronome. Lay down our hats. Now let's look at our new browser sync auditioning. This allows any sample that has embedded tempo to be time stretched and synchronized to your track instantly. So I'm gonna start a loop and go over to my browser and now I can audition any loop in time with my beat. This enables me to find different types of loops that fit my song idea. So as you can see, it starts in sync and it's all in tempo. This is because it's utilizing the warp engine and the synchronization. So I can load this straight to my clip. Now we'll look for another part, add some percussion. There we go, preview. So let's open up a new audio track and add the loop. Now we can continue this process bring up the volume of the shakers. The great thing about this feature is that I can go through all my loops and I can instantly hear what works over my idea. 